Hello and welcome to SourceCAD. In this video, I will tell you about converting the unit of a drawing. Most of the time I get this question, how can I convert my drawing from one unit to another? For example, you made your drawing in Imperial and later on you just find out that you need your drawing in MM or maybe you are exporting your drawing to someone who has their drawing in MM. For that, you need to change the units inside your drawing. So I'll first start with DWG units. So here we have a drawing and this is a simple rectangle in which the length is 10 units and width is 5 units. So by unit I mean the default unit of the drawing. So let's see what's the default unit right now. For that type UN for units and press enter. Here you can see that the insertion scale is set to inches. And that simply means that all the drawings imported in this current drawing will be converted to inches. Also we have this current drawing in inches and here we have a precision of four decimal places and it's indicated as decimal now let's click on ok and now let's type di for distance and press enter now let's check the distance between these two points and here we have it on the command line you'll notice that that length is 10 units now let's check it again for width and you'll notice that it is here five units so this 10 and 5 unit is actually inches so the length is 10 inches and width is 5 inches for this rectangle now let's see how we can convert it for converting it into some other unit let's take the unit as millimeter for this example we need to enter command dash dwg units now make sure you enter this dash or negative symbol before dwg units command now press enter now here we have some options by default inches is selected and here on the list you'll notice some of the common units in which you can convert this drawing inches is on the first number here one is selected that simply indicates the current drawing is in inches now if you want to convert it to some other units then select the appropriate value from this list so we want to convert it into millimeters and millimeters is at third position so let's type three and press enter now we have some more options to select it's indicating whether we want the unit to be in scientific or decimal we want it in decimal so let's type two press enter now the precision let's keep it at four digits of decimal and press enter and now whether we want to scale the objects which are inserted in the drawing so obviously we want that all the drawings which are inserted in this current drawing should be scaled accordingly let's press enter and also press enter in this option and now here we have one more option this basically asks you whether you want to convert the existing drawing into the new scale the new scale of millimeter so currently our drawing is in inches and we are converting units to mm so whether we want to convert its scale as well or not that's what this command line is prompting you to select so obviously we want to convert the scale for this drawing as well so let's press y or yes or directly press enter because yes is selected by default and press enter now our drawing is also converted we have the last option here which prompts you to select whether we want to change scales for paper space object or not so yes we want it for paper space also and paper space simply means this layout view press enter and now here we have our drawing in a new scale although you might not be able to see the drawing here because of change of scale so in order to make it appear again double click your middle mouse button this will apply zoom extends command and your drawing will fit completely now let's go and check it again so let's type di and press enter now let's click at this point and then click at this point and now let's look here here we have the distance as 254 units and that is exactly 254 mm and you must be already aware that one inch is equal to 25.4 mm so obviously we have here 10 inches that equals 254 mm and that's the result we are getting so that means our drawing is converted into mm now so in this way you can convert the scale of a drawing in this drawing if you import any drawing which is not in mm then also it will be converted because we have selected the same option the option of conversion into the appropriate unit while applying dwg units command so you don't need to worry about that so i hope you like this video if you have any questions related to units then do let me know in the comment box and don't forget to share and subscribe this video thanks again for watching